Okay, well, we're going to perform a California mastitis test on this cow. Uh, that's going to test her to see if she's got subclinical mastitis, and it'll look for any uh, quarters that are about 400,000 or more uh, in terms of cell count, so it's useful in herds that don't milk record. What we're going to do is use the paddle, uh, which has got four little wells. We can collect a milk sample from each quarter into that, and then we need some of the reagent handy, which is a detergent-type reagent. So the first thing we'll do is get some milk from each one of the quarters. So we have the milk from each one of each quarter of the cow. Uh, we know which one they responds to which quarter because we watched when we were doing it um, and made sure from the direction we've done it that we can record which one's which. We can then tilt the paddle over so that we've got three mils left in each, which is shown by one of these lines marking the graduation on both sides. So we know we've now got an even amount. And then we get the reagent, add the same and equal volume as the reagent as the milk. So we swirl this round and what you're doing is looking for a gel type reaction. You can see that in here these have all gelled up whereas this one looks more milky and is easier to move, swirl around the paddle. So these three are going to show up positive reactions which means they have a cell count in the region of 400,000 or higher and this can form a basis of either our treatment or our sampling that we might want them to go ahead and do for the cow.